What is up guys, it is Echo Soldier here and welcome to another Minecraft Xbox 360 edition title of day 9 video. Now this video is a community video and it is by Magic Studios, the link to his channel is in the description, make sure you check him out, make sure you subscribe, he's explained everything in TU9, all the items and how they work. But apart from that, enjoy this community video, peace out. <laughs> Hey guys, Magic Studios here, and today, um, today is April 4th, and the update, Title Update 9 for Minecraft Xbox 360 Edition, has been released. So, this is just a quick video, it's about, I'm going to guess around 5 minutes long, it's going to be about all the new things that Minecraft has to offer for our Xbox players. So without further ado, let's begin. Nether brick slabs have been introduced to the game, you just place them like regular slabs. Three different kinds of wood added with their corresponding slabs. Three new types of wood with their corresponding stairs. On the topic of wood, they've added a wooden button. It acts exactly like a stone button, it's just a wooden button. Almost forgot to mention sandstone stairs have been introduced to the game as well. Item frames have been introduced to the game as well. Um, did you know that you can also click left trigger on them and they will rotate 90 degrees? A new item that's also been introduced to the game are fire charges. All you gotta do is click left trigger and they light stuff on fire. Put them in a dispenser and you've got yourself a flamethrower. Buckets are now stackable up to 16, as well as signs. Gravel got a new texture in the update as well. You can now put another rack into a furnace and you'll get yourself some nether brick. Fence gates can now be opened via redstone. Creature eggs and mob eggs have been added to the game. You put them in a dispenser and you can just spawn as many animals as you want. 